Yo, what's up, y'all? This is Jairus Mosey, a.k.a. J-Mo. I'm here checking out the Steve Lacey People Pleaser Stratocaster, and it's a freaking beast, man. Check it out. So I've known Steve since he was 10 years old. He was a little child in a church I was playing at. Um, and his mother and him came up to me after service one time. And, you know, Steve with almost a tear in his eye. And they all, and they asked me, could I teach him to play guitar? And um, pretty much I said, yeah. I taught him for about six months. Um, I went, I started touring with Lil Wayne. So I couldn't teach him anymore. So I went on the road. And then he went off, did his thing. He did like jazz classes and stuff in high school. And then he started with the internet, with the internet band. He was uh, probably like, I don't know his exact age, but he was probably 14, 15 years old. And uh, yeah, his career just took off from there, man. And um, actually, uh, it came so full circle that, you know, he's able to have me here talking about this right now. And it's weird. <laughs> So this guitar has a beautiful alder body, chaos burst finish, as you can see. It has player plus noiseless single coil pickups. Uh, probably some of the best pickups you can find, honestly. Like, super quiet, no noise, uh, perfect for the studio, on stage. Um, and also, you know, you get a bright sound and a warm sound uh, with this guitar. You, get, you cover all spectrum, so I love it. has a beautiful feature that I really love. It has a custom onboard fuzz that you punch this little button right here, just boop, 
you know what I'm saying? You got an amazing fuzz solo channel. So it's like, it's one of those things, man, that I saw Steve use on stage. I was like, wow, like, really? That's how you gonna do it? You know what I'm saying? But uh, man, like to be able to start off with solo clean and end off with a fuzz, you know, build it up. That's like an amazing feature to have on a guitar. It's one of a kind. This is pretty much the main reason I would buy this guitar. One of the main reasons, because this beautiful feature, like nobody has this right now. Like nobody has a fuzz in the guitar. Like just imagine that. Like, so yeah. And this guitar has a beautiful dice inlay on the 12th fret. Um, Steve is a very eclectic guy. You know, he's very uh, aesthetic, you know what I'm saying? So he wants you to look at this guitar and get a, you know, just a nice different vibe from what you're used to seeing on a guitar. So that's why I'm pretty sure he put these inlays, you know what I'm saying, just to stand out. And that's what you want when you're, you know, you're out playing. You want to have something that, you know, people can look at and it looks good along with your plan. So. Yeah, it has these beautiful uh, dice inlays, uh, sunburst body. It's just a beautiful guitar. Yeah, y'all, if that wasn't enough, you also get a vintage style hard case. It's fuzzy, green, furry. It looks friendly. It's just freaking stylish, man. You know, grab that. Stop playing. Mm -hmm. 